And of course he catches nothing but a log. Hey guys, it's Vi. Welcome back to the Drifter Challenge, house number three. We are currently on episode number 77. If you missed, if you missed last episode, truth be told, you didn't miss much. I was having a heck of a time trying to get all of everybody in this party, all the family members, to congregate in one spot and behave themselves. I don't know why, but I can't get it through my brain to use the group option. It doesn't click. I can't remember to do that. And I'm stuck on this. Once they're in a conversation, I can just tell them to go here together and it should work. Honestly, I don't know why it doesn't because that would just make things so much easy. That's why. So instead, um, we watched me struggle through the entire episode, trying to get them to all behave, trying to tend to their needs. I have found that since Axel is an elder, his stats especially his energy and his hunger and his bladder, those three in particular seem to be going down at a more rapid pace. Now, I don't play elders very much, and so um, I'm not sure if that's like a side effect of being an elder in the game or if that's just something I noticed because of I don't know why. Um, I don't have enough points to buy these fancy potions to fix things, and um, yeah, so that's pretty much what's happening right now. Um, I don't know what she's doing. Oh, she's over there cooking something. Oh, well, good for you. Okay, so Axel, why don't you, if I, I gotta click on this, we're gonna change something else. Now, I was gonna have them all, oh, you just totally tooted. Uh, I was going to have them all fishing over here, but it seems like they did not all follow me over here, even though we're all currently grouped, everyone in the family. So as soon as I can find it, where is that spinach? There it is. We're going to go fishing with spinach, and I'm going to see if, uh, if Axel cannot find our last fish. I keep calling it something, and I think I'm calling it incorrectly, so I'm actually going to come over here, and I'm going to click on the fish. We're going to find out what it's called because I can't remember. Oh, it doesn't tell me, obviously, because it has not been found. Okay, I want to say it's called the lionfish, and I didn't bring my notes this time because I didn't. So Maribel is right here. She is confused because well, I don't know what she's doing. But we're going to fish for a bit because Axel needs some fun in his life. But aside from that, his stats look fantastic. So I wanted him to do some fishing. I had to extend their vacation by another day because, like I said, I spent the whole last episode, which was almost uh, most of the day for them, I spent most of it running around and not doing anything of what I wanted to do. That's a little on the loud side, if I'm not mistaken. So I'm going to turn down just a little bit. He just caught a walleye. So I'm going to... I'm just gonna let him do some fishing for a while, folks. And I think what I'm gonna do is plug in some fun music so you guys can listen so that you're not wasting your time. When I catch it, if I catch it, you'll hear from me. Okay, so we have been fishing for a, quite a bit, actually, and um, I have been using the spinach. I think I'm going to up my game just a little bit, and we're going to try fishing with something totally different. I'm going to say we're going to start fishing with some blackberries. They're worth quite a bit of money, and so I'm wondering if they're, like, higher on the list for these more difficult-to-catch fish. So we're going to give that a try, and we're going to go fishing for a short bit or a while. Long time. We're going to fish for a bit because I really, really want the fish, folks. That's what we're here to do. Maribel has decided to come fishing with me. How cool is that? Awesome. Hi, Maribel. And of course, he catches nothing but a log. Not awesome. And bye, Miss Maribel. All 
Alrighty, so I caught a bunch of new things. We got some crawdads in different colors. So we've got we've got the blue crawdad, we've got this one, which is the red crawdad. He found a couple things of showers, or just a couple showers, not things of, of showers. He caught a couple showers, so I'm gonna go ahead and uh well actually you know what? <laughs> we should put one out for everyone to use. Can we do that? I don't know. Maybe you can't. I'm not sure. I thought maybe you could, but I don't know. Okay, so you boys, come over here. Everybody, come on, come on, come on. Let's do some fishing. You guys can help out. Maybe it'll be a little more exciting. Ooh, look. We got this um, Captain Fishbone's Bonefish. Okay, so they are there, and they are doing some fishing. Axel is needing to use the restroom. Um, I'm going to see if I can't put a shower out up here. I, I don't know if you can or if you actually have to... You have to place in world. Yeah, okay. So he has gotten three showers so far. So I'm going to go ahead and sell two of those because we don't really need more than one. So we're going to go ahead and sell both of those. Um, he's currently fishing here with with uh, little Dallas here. They're having a, a party here. They're playing at this fishing hole. You know, something I haven't tried is tried to use a frog. So, Axel, we're going to swap your bait now with a frog. So, we're going to go fishing, and we're going to fish with bait. And I'm actually going to choose a frog this time because I'm wondering, you know, which one is it? The piranha or, you know, the, I don't know, some of these other ones, they require that you have frogs. So, we're going to try one. I don't want to use a really good one. This one's worth 125 $10 frog. Fantastic. Let's try it out and see what happens. I saw it jumping just a few moments ago, so I know that it exists in there. Yeah. Axel's tired. Axel needs to use the restroom. Axel's hungry, and he needs social. So he's going to, like, he's not going to be obeying me because he's really uncomfortable. So unfortunately, I'm not going to be able to do that yet. We're going to have to come over here and work on our stats a little bit. So we're going to use the pote. Oh, he's crying about him. Oh, but we have someone else. Look, we have a new hermit over here. All right, well, we're going to sleep over here. All right, so that's a thing. This episode is probably another fail episode because I just can't get with the program. It seems like his needs and stuff need to happen so much more. I'm going to extend the vacation for one last day. I need to check and see how long do we even have to catch this fish. I'm spending so much time over here. We have three days, folks. Three days left until he becomes a young adult. In those three days, I need to get Axel to find this fish. I need to get Axel... Let me see how many more. We need to get Axel... Come on, skills. We need to get him two more points in handiness in three days so he can catch the two remaining fish. Truthfully, if I don't catch this fish today, this episode or maybe next episode, I'm going to pretty much consider it a bust that that fish is just not going to happen for me and move on from that and try to get into the grotto because I don't know. I still want to try to get into the grotto. I personally have never been in there and I thought it would be really cool to see the grotto. So lately I have been um, editing out the sleeping portions or, you know, when he's going on mass harvesting sprees a couple episodes ago, I just kind of put a, like a montage of music with it and stopped at key important parts. Would you guys do me a favor and leave me comments down below. Tell me, do you like that better or do you like the 100% real time gathering everything that I do? Or do you kind of like it when I just you know, speed it up, add some music, stop when certain things happen, but for the most part, it just kind of speeds it up and goes through it. Um, I'm fine doing it either way. I just thought it might be kind of nice and maybe a little bit of a time saver if I just kind of sped through those little bits. Just let me know which uh, option you guys think is best for, for this challenge. I would really like to know. Your input really does mean a lot to me. I love reading your comments and everything. It's just fantastic. Alrighty, so Axel has woken up now, or at least he will in just a moment. Um, I am going to, I don't know what flavor ice means, but uh, we're not going to do that one. He's going to cook, and I don't know what we're cooking, but let's find out. What do we want to cook now? So we have lots and lots of different choices, and I think what we want to do, this is different. I've never been able to do this one before. 
Um, it's gumbo. Um, I don't think I've ever created gumbo before. So let's see. That is as a whole pot of gumbo. Fine. So that means multiple people. Maybe I'll get everybody to come here. And it looks like the toilet is broken, which is very unfortunate. That's not good at all. So get your gumbo created. Let's check it out. What does this gumbo look like here? You know, it looks strangely like uh, Franks and Beans with... I don't know. It looks like little green things and maybe maybe that's seafood? Like shrimp in there? I don't know. I've never had gumbo. What is gumbo? Do you know what gumbo is? If you do, comments down below. Tell me what is this fabled food I've never heard of. And I cook a lot of stuff and I've never heard of gumbo in my life. So let's uh, grab a serving, call to meal. That's good. Call everyone to meal. Maybe everybody will show up. I don't know. I don't think they're in a group anymore. Uh, let's find out. Let's group them up if they are not. More choices, actions, form a group. We're going to form a group with all of them. I don't know why they aren't in a group, but uh, I thought they were in one, but apparently not. So let's have a conversation with Hunter since you're here. Let's let's uh, share our fishing tips with him. Um, Axel bought... Where is it? Where is it? I don't know. Okay. So he bought Mentor from the reward store. Once mentors reach level 10 in certain skills, the mentor interaction becomes available and they can help other Sims improve their skills even more quickly. And it's it was a reward trait that I purchased. Now, he just gave his son the fishing skill. And I don't know if he can mentor him or not because um, I don't think that that's one that you can do. But, you know, we'll just we'll, we'll keep talking fishing with him. And we'll see what happens. Get him some skills. He needs one more skill up to level two in order to go up at school. Oh, no, he finally did. He finally went up. Good for him. So he hasn't done any homework. That's okay. That's okay. Not done your homework. That's okay. That's all right. What else do we need to do here? You have a hygiene issue. So I want you to actually repair this toilet, take a shower, and... I don't know. We're going to have to go back and do some more fishing now that he has gotten his stats up at least decent. Okay, um, little hermit lady, you need to get out of there because he's going to be going in there. Yes, indeed. He's here, so you need to skedaddle, please, so he can get in there and fix it. Wow, he fixed that, like, super, super fast, folks. Like, that went really fast. And I need him to use the potty. Oh, I need to go in there. Let's go ahead and scavenge for parts while you're waiting, Axel, to give you something to do. Um, bills have just been delivered, so we're going to have to to do that. Um, you're going to use the loo in here. Tell your son to skedaddle. And then after that, I think I'm going to attempt once again to tell them all to come fishing together. And we're just going to fish with no bait. We're just literally going to fish. So, Axel, let's go fishing. Let's see what happens I don't know. Maybe, I mean, I tried all kinds of different bait. So maybe it's time that we literally just go fishing. We don't use any bait, any bait. We just straight up go fishing. I've been trying to get the family to come fishing together, but because of needs and other stuff, they, mm, they said no. So it looks like the fish in the area is too crafty for Isaac. So he doesn't want to fish here. And it looks like Hunter is too tired. Maribel is sleeping. I don't know. This whole fishing together, it just is not working. I was really hoping to get everyone to go fishing to up my chances that we will catch the fish. But I don't know if that's going to happen. His stats are decent, except he needs someone to chit-chat with. So I think, once again, we're going to settle down for a short stint of fishing. But I'm looking at the time, folks, and it is time to wrap up this episode of the Drifter Challenge, house number three. You have been watching episode number 77, I believe it was. I can't remember, but I want to say that it's episode number 77. And I'm hopeful that the next episode we will get to a chance to catch that fish. If we do not, however, we are still going to be heading home, I think, because time is running out, folks. We don't have very much time to get him some handiness, skill, etc. before Hunter ages to a young adult. My gosh, I cannot believe it's almost here. So I hope you enjoyed this episode of the Drifter Challenge, and I hope to see you next time. So until next time, guys, take care. Bye. Click this video to watch the Drifter Challenge from beginning with house number one, episode one. It's a series with over 125 videos in it, so it'll provide you with plenty of content to binge watch.
Click this link to hear an important message and see the music video that I put together using footage from my real life fairy tale vlog videos. Go on, click a video. It's okay. I'll wait. Go on, click one. What are you waiting for? Just do it. You know you want to.